now we are done with the first part of our chapter this was on perfect competition let's just do a short quiz on this topic first question which of these are characteristics of perfect competition a many sellers and buyers b homogeneous products c free entry and exit d all of the above the answer is all of the above because all of them are the characteristics of perfect competition many sellers and buyers homogeneous products free entry and exit all of them are its characteristics let's check yes that's the answer next what are the conditions for the long run equilibrium of the competitive firm a lmc equals to lac equals to p b smc equals to sac equals to lmc c p equals to mr d all of these the answer is all of these let's check that's the answer so in short we can say in long run lmc equals to lac equals to smc equals to sac equals to p equals to d equals to ar equals to mr in the long run all of these meet at the same point so all of them become equal if under perfect competition the price line lies below the average cost curve the firm would a make only normal profits incur losses make abnormal profit d profit cannot be determined the answer is it will incur losses let's check that's the answer next which of the following is not the feature of an imperfect competition a product differentiation b few sellers c homogeneous products d price wars the answer is c homogeneous products you don't have homogeneous products in a imperfect competition imperfect competition is a competition which is not perfect let's check that's the answer next in perfect competition when the firm is a price taker which curve among the following will be a straight line a marginal cost b average cost c total cost d marginal revenue the curve that is a straight line generally it is a line which is parallel to the x axis and it is marginal revenue curve let's check that's the answer